hello, hang on, scooch. Um, I just upload, I'm just made an update video, so if you haven't seen that, please watch it. I got a crap ton of new animal content because it's been so long, so I got a brand new rescue literally a couple weeks ago, and I just wanted to share her before I rehome her, so. My pancake. So this is my new rescue. Um, say hi. She's very pretty. Look at those markings. Look at that tail. She's very gorgeous. Um, okay, so hi. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. If that's comfortable for you, it's not very comfortable for me. Um, okay. So I think this one's a juvenile bearded dragon. Um, definitely not full grown bearded dragon. Probably more like a juvenile. I wasn't sure if she was a juvenile or not because sometimes reptiles get stunted growth and this dragon has been really poorly treated. So um, pretty sure it's a juvenile though just because of her eating habits and her poop habits. So, um, but she is a female bearded dragon um, that I rescued a few weeks ago. And um, I got it from my store. I had some customers come in and they were like, we have a bear dragon in our car right now in a cage. And we got it from someone, we got it from a friend who had a neighbor. So she's been passed down like four times already. And they just didn't know what to do with this dragon. And when I tell you her care was atrocious. When I saw her, I was so concerned. I said, okay, they want to take care of it themselves. And I was like, I, they had no idea what they were doing. So I just, I offered and I was like, hey, if you don't know what you're doing, I will gladly take the dragon off your hands and I will rehabilitate her myself um, because I have rehabilitated many animals before, including another bearded dragon in the past, which I made a whole video about. And by the way, I kept her. She came in like a, probably about a four by two by two customized wooden enclosure. It smelled like cat piss. It was covered in moldy vegetables, dried up bearded dragon poop everywhere, repta carpet, just soiled on. It looked like it hadn't been cleaned in like weeks and there was no heat bulbs in the heat lamp so i don't know how long she hasn't had heat for so i thought i was gonna keep the cage at first but i ended up changing my mind after scrubbing it but i can show you the pictures it was completely awful and uh when i picked her up she was like half dead freezing wouldn't move now she's the most active little thing in the world um she was super dehydrated you could tell because her skin was just super saggy she was super skinny you can still tell she's skinny she's got some you can still see her hip bones she's missing two to two fingernails as well possibly from the repta carpet just ripping out her nails um so she's missing two nails right now she's in a 40 gallon with just some paper towel and i've just been giving her a whole salad bowl and then i feed her the biggest fattest meal of her life every single day so um, she gets lots of bugs. She's got quite the character. After some heat in the first 24 hours, she perked up like that. So, I mean, my other dragon is just a lazy piece of crap. Look at you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Yeah, but she's she's doing good. She's a, she's a good dragon. I'm not keeping her, unfortunately. I'm probably gonna rehome her. Um, my plan is once I get my reptile section at my store finished, um, and she's all better. I'm going to rehome her only to someone who's experienced. I do not want to rehome her to someone who's never had a bearded dragon in their life. I want to rehome them to someone. I want to rehome her to someone who's ha had reptiles before and knows the proper care of reptiles and isn't just getting started with it. I want them to actually know and understand because I do not want her to end up in the same situation she was in before. We're gonna get her all better. <laughs> um, but this is my little rescue right now. She's very pretty. Very, very pretty. Yes. She's always attentive and watching everything that I do. She's like, she's funny. So um, she, she runs around like a crazy lunatic. So she's a good dragon. So if you enjoyed this video, Please like and subscribe. 
Ooh, do not fall. That's a very bad idea. And I'll see you all in another video. Also follow my other social medias because I don't know how often I'll post YouTube videos. Okay, she wants to go. Ugh. Okay, 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 bye. I have no idea how, but I didn't even realize the ball to this piercing fell off when I was first filming videos. And I have no idea where it went. And I found it like an old jewelry and I put that ball on, but I have no idea what happened to the other one. And I just realized that now I am surprised the whole bar didn't even fall out of my lip. Shocking, okay.